All right, so we're going to look at a new commandlet in PowerShell 3. So if you don't have PowerShell 3, you can get the community preview online right now. Or if you don't know which version you're running, you can type get host into the console, run it, and you'll see the version right here. So we have 3.0, and we're ready to rock. Now the commandlet is called show command. And what this does is give you a visual representation of the options for whatever command let you provide to it as a parameter so we're gonna start with get child item and when I run this you'll see that a Windows form pops up with text boxes that I can enter the information and check boxes for different parameters that it would have and down here we even have another menu with common parameters uh, that you'll find in many commandlets um, so let's see we're using get child item so we want to grab some information from some folder so I need to provide it a path and let's go ahead and use the um, example that I use all the time Stop. whoops lots of crap so there's lots of crap in that lots of crap folder and uh, let's recurse to go down all of the, all of the directories and let's even refine it so that we only get text files so you also notice that there's tabs up here um, and these tabs are for different parameter sets you don't have to use both of them we're just gonna stick with this items tab here and I think we have all the required information filled out so let's go ahead and run it and see what happens and you'll see that it has successfully pulled all the text files from um, all of the directories in that one directory that I provided it so there's lots of crap and even more stuff and there's some crap text files uh, even more stuff there's even further yeah so there's there's all the text files in that folder so that was a really simple way to see um, visually what we can do with that commandlet now let's take a look at another commandlet here I'm just gonna delete this these files that I created already um, we're gonna use the new item commandlet let's run it and that let's say you're you're not familiar uh, with some of these options that you see here uh, like use transaction what's that for I don't know what that's for well we have this little button up here that brings up a forms view of the help file that would be displayed if you were to type get help new item so we can scroll through it uh, we can search through it so let's type enough to find the transaction so we have six matches let's go ahead and scroll down and here's the information for use transaction uh, it's just a switch includes the command in the active transaction this blah 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 so we can learn more about uh, the options that we saw in that form view and if we want we can even click settings here and uh, refine the uh, help display even more so we can get rid of, of the description get rid of the examples hit OK and it shortens the code uh, the help view that we have here so let's get out of that and we'll come back into the new item so I'm gonna create a new item here I need to give it a path C colon users fern desktop and we're gonna call this test.txt and we want to make a file and we can even add some data in there so test data now before I ran the command from this form menu but what I can also do is come down here and click copy well, I'm gonna click that and what that does is uh, copies a copy of the command to your clipboard so when I paste it let's go ahead and comment that out we can see how the command would look on the command line and I have my path here uh, the item type and the value so I can equally run it now this way and it was successfully created let's open that file so we have test.txt with our test data inside of it so that's the show command commandlet and it's really a good resource for people that want to learn more about the different commandlets and uh, have quick access to the help file so that they can 
go through and learn more about the things that they see inside of that form view. Uh, so that's it. That's show command. Thanks for watching.